Welcome to this quick demonstration of adding images to forms using Form Maker. And we'll start off by creating a new form and we'll call it Test. And it's going to be a grid format form. So there we are, it's created our form. At the moment it's empty, so I'll go into design mode. And there we are in design mode. And if we look down the left hand side here at our list of controls, we'll see the image control there. So I'll drag that on. And I can make that a little bit bigger or a little bit smaller if I want to. So if I want to make it cover the full width of the form, I can do that. So that's our default little image that comes up just to show us where the control is. I click on it and click on it again. And you'll see that these are the images here that we have to pick from at the moment. And obviously these are just the ones that came with the form. So they're unlikely to be the ones we actually want. So to add our own images to the bank of images we can pick from, we use this little plus button here. So press, the, please, uh, sorry, press the button to add a new item. There we are. So we press that button there, and it uh, it goes into our library. This is the iOS Photo Library, where we can pick an image, such as this one here. This is a standard one that came with iOS, and I could go to the camera roll, select a different image there. So now I've added two of my own images here and I can just pick one of those. You can see the little red uh, line around that image, that's the one that's currently selected. I can move it to here if I want to. So I could pick that image. So if I now press the tick to say yes that's what I want to do. There we go. It's picked that image and uh, kept the aspect ratio of the original image and put it onto the form. So now when I run that form, there we go, there's the image. Now if I want to have multiple images, so I want to scroll across the images because I want to have a few of them, I can do that. So I go into click again there. And you see this button here, allow multiple images. At the moment it's off, so if I select another image, it just moves to that image. So if I said, yeah, that's the one I want, that's the one it will pick. So if I click on allow multiple images, I can now select more than one image at a time. So now it's selected this one and this one. Or if I can click off that one, it's selected this one and that one and that one. And I can add as many as I want. So that's the allow multiple, multiple images. So I click now. There we go. And we can see that down the bottom here, we've now got one of these little uh, page control dots. So when I run the form, That'll move that little scroller page control across. And that's quite nice. That's the standard um, image sweeping feature you expect to see in iOS. So that's how you, uh, how you add images. If you wanted to just add images without being in a form, you can do that. If you go down to the image manager, we can see these are the ones that came with the app. Uh, and See, image added 19, image added 18. Those are the ones I added myself just a, a moment ago. Um, and I can change the names of those just for my own reference. So I could uh, call this one um, iOS uh, Leaf. That's fine. So if I want to add one now, I can again click the plus button down the bottom and give it a name. And I'll call this. Uh, I'll just call this a view. And it goes to the camera roll. And I can pick my view. Well, I've already selected that one before, haven't I? But there we are. You get the idea. So I can add images here, or I could delete them. I could, for instance, delete this one here with that minus this delete button. So that's deleted that one. I could delete the one I've just added. So I can use the image manager to add and delete, rename images, um, or the easier thing to do is just to go into um, into a form in design mode. Again, I'll just drag in a new image. That's a, a new image field I've just dragged on. And click the little plus button there. And then let's go into the camera roll. Let's, let's have the waterfall. That's quite a nice image. Uh, plus there, add the image. You can then select it, press the tick, and it'll add that image to your form. And if you want to have more than one image and scroll across them, select the Allow Multiple Images button 
and um, select your multiple images. So now when I run this form, we've got our images at the top and we've got our images at the bottom. So that's adding images to forms using FormMaker and that's all there is to it.